silver all right we want to analyze the silver for the next week but before that I want to just explain uh, about our analysis in the last video okay if you refer back to my last video when the price was here we we analyze the chart based on the both possibility the price can move high, move up or move down all right one of the things I highlight there that's why I say there some of the traders if they are interested the I mean any traders that are interested they can trade this one even I highlight it but I say I'm not interested in this because I, I mentioned that there is a possibility the price can correct all right this is what we can see that's mean if anyone want getting this trade they shouldn't have I mean maybe get the break even or they didn't have enough profit that's why I was I mentioned I'm not interested that's why I give a second option for the buy and after that we see there is a possibility the price can correct here I when come to this high then from there we the price move down anyway the price dropped but we didn't get any uh, sell setup all right but uh, now we see the, the price is correcting here since it's the end of the week we cannot trade this one but if it was in the middle of the week maybe we could uh, consider as a correction for the next move down anyway we don't have any trade setup here right now and one more things I wanted to highlight here that in my last video when the price was here that's mean when, when the price only was correcting here we say we can have entry it depends on the traders if they want to trade whether here or here in case the price sharp move down all right but when we see this kind of the correction after this we see how the price correct here then when we have this kind of the move then this kind of the this entry is not valid all right or if anyone wants to have entry then the entry cannot be here it should be somewhere around here or here anyway if anyone wants it to uh, still they wanted to trade this type of the entry when they see this kind of the move and they see this correcting they should take out the trade all right because this type of the I mean then is not valid this uh, trade anyway we just move uh, to a daily chart we start to analyze for our next week as we can see the price is correcting here all right we don't have much information then we refer back to uh, we refer to a forward chart now we want to see how we can trade for next week we see that we have a small correction here all right what i can say here next week the price if the price correct here and come lower and lower then from there we will be more interested in the buy that's mean if we get any buy we will be interested then if we get the buy the price come to this level whether it can continue or not then we make a decision all right this is what we interested if we can get next week now i move to one hour chart all right based on the one hour chart as i say if next week the market open if we see this kind of type of the correction or if the price uh, correct here more maybe we can get the sell similar to what we have here that's mean there is a possibility whether the price from here drop or it correct similar to what we have here that's mean it give us correction then it depends on the traders and it depends on the chart whether we can get the sell setup or not anyway again this situation can be repeat here the price correct and drop correct and drop if we see this type of the correction that's mean then we, we will as I just now we mentioned based on the day forward chart we are more interested in the buy okay this is what we are expecting for the last I mean for the next week but how about the price if from here sharply move up we don't buy unless it came to this level because until it came to this level because there is a possibility from here the, the price sharply to move come to this level then we will have one move one two three flat then the price from there drop okay that's why if we want to trade we prefer to get the correction here whether the deeper correction the price drop at least to this level then we see whether we can get the buy setup or not and any sharp move to this level we don't buy unless the price come to this level or correct from here give us a trade setup then above this tr 
I mean above this level then if we get a trade setup we can uh, look into the chart whether we can buy or not but within this one we don't buy anyway this is the only information we have for the next week we and uh, then uh, we just follow the chart next week when we, the market open we see how the price can correct here what type of the what kind of the information we get then from there we make our judgment and if there is any new information I will share on YouTube. Thanks.